first, congratulations on walking this red carpet. How does it feel being part of, I consider this music history all the time. Okay. Yeah, it's awesome. I mean, I think the, the Canadian music industry is in a really good place now more than ever, you know, so it feels cool to be in the presence of greatness. No, I wanted to double check. Are you nominated tonight? Yes. What are you nominated for? Um, for R&B, the best R&B, yeah. You know what? This is the thing that I'm loving. Canadians, when it comes to R&B, there seems to be a different flavor that's going on, but people are jumping on it. You know it's Canadian, but at the same time, you know it's different. And you seem to be part of this trend. What do you think it is that you guys are doing now that really is making it our own, but like I said, a great but different flavor? Um, I mean, I think it's just that's that's where we're at in music in general, where, you know, genres are a little bit more, a little bit grayer. It's like, you know, if we're doing R&B, hopefully there's a tinge of every other element that we've grown up on. And, you know, so it's kind of, it's just kind of, I don't know, I guess it's an amalgamation of everyone's influences. And for me, R&B is a part of my influence, so it's in there. Now, what's just the recording that you did? Pardon? What's the recording that was nominated? Uh, it's called Stone Woman. It's an EP. I know you're busy, man. I, got one. I know the one! I know! Fantastic. Okay, now I don't feel like I'm going. Psh, damn, that is a good record. Thank you so much. Oh What's going to happen in the future now? Now that you have this, um, keep writing, keep making music, get more nominations. You know, this is just the beginning. Nominations and wins. Look, I'm going to let you go. Enjoy yourself. Have a great time and congratulations on the nomination. Thank you so much. Nice to meet you.